Alpha earthquake today near Ridgecrest on display as one home there burst into flames. And 23 ABC's Leslie Gooden was in Ridgecrest with more from that family who's felt the impact of that devastating fire. Yes, you all. I'm standing right here near a home where a fire actually happened and we're able to talk with the home resident who tells us he was actually inside when it started and he's grateful to got it out. And as I'm standing here right now, you can still smell the smoke in the air. Oh, that's the biggest rock and roll I've had here in about five of them I've had over the years. Jack Minton, homeowner who lives just off of Sunland and California Avenue, says he was at a local donut shop. He felt the earthquake. But nothing like that. It went on forever, it seemed like. There was a lot of movement. Minton says that he then went home and was inside the home when the fire began, and he believes it was a water heater that might have started the fire. It was probably about 15, 20 minutes after the earthquake. By the time I came home, and checked it out. Nothing was wrong when I first got here. Uh, in fact, some 10 minutes later before I actually uh, spotted the fire in the garage. 23 ABC is told that the store Big Lots and other establishments suffered interior damages and not exterior for the most part. Minton is one of the hundreds of individuals who have been impacted by this earthquake. Minton says that he hasn't been able to assess all the damage yet, but he did lose two collectible cars and is grateful to be alive. And Ridgecrest, Luzzle Gooden, 23 ABC News, connecting you.